Hello, everybody, and happy Thanksgiving. Today is November 24th, 2022, and it is Thanksgiving uh, 2022. So happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Um, I just wanted to share uh, where I am today and what's going on, okay? So for those who don't know me, I am Jacqueline Lawrence. Thank you so much for tuning in to the book of Eris Jacqueline. And um, I am a jewelry designer, amongst other things. And so, as a matter of fact, I made these earrings. I make Afrocentric earrings. And the name of my business is Eve's Tribe. And I'm getting ready for my big Black Friday sale tomorrow. I'm having two virtual sales tomorrow. And then I'm having Cyber Monday sales. Two Cyber Monday sales on three different Mondays coming up. So I'm so excited. Um, but like I said, today is Thanksgiving. And... Um, I just want to keep it real about um, where I am today on Thanksgiving Day. So I'm here alone by myself. I know, I know I'm not alone. God is with me. Of course God is with me. God is always with me. His name is Emmanuel. God is with us. I understand that. But I'm talking about a human being in my house. There is no other I know, no big deal. To you, you say, okay, but let me see you do it, <laughs> okay? And, you know, to some people, it is a big deal. You may be strong and got it going on, sister or brother, and don't need nobody, but for some of of us, it is kind of a big deal to spend um, Thanksgiving alone, See, I grew up where the holidays were a huge deal. But me personally, I had to come to terms with the fact that true love is not just shown on Thanksgiving and at Christmas time. And so I'm not one to fake my funk and I'm not one to be around too much fake funkin'. So I decided to stay where I knew real love was. And that is here alone with, yes, he's with me, I'm with him. My God, who is Emmanuel? No, there's no smell of turkey and dressing and greens and... No, I haven't bought any new outfit for the day. No fall colors. Uh, no, uh, I didn't clean my house and I'm not running around stressed out for special guests and people who call themselves friends to come over to visit me. I'm just a single 61-year-old woman um, who's trying to live my life on my terms and on real terms. Um, and what's real to me is uh, I'm raising my granddaughter and she did go with the family. So that's good. She got to go. Really, she just wanted to spend time with the cat. Um, so she's gone and I am home alone preparing for my big day tomorrow, which is, uh, which launches my Black Friday sale. So that's what I'm excited about. Um, and I'm just so grateful for so much. You know what? It's the 24th of November. So I've been 61 for a whole month. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, but I put my rent in the mailbox, in the, in the slot yesterday my december rent amidst everything and y'all just don't know my situation but i'll tell you a little of it i haven't paid rent at my last place since december of last year because of work situations and then the month that they lifted 
the rent moratorium where it was okay for you to stay in your place the month that they lifted it i got another place and i love it i love it i'm so happy here i'm in fairfield close to my church and i get to go to church i'm so thankful for that i'm just so thankful for so much in spite of the fact that thanksgiving for me is not traditional but i just have so much to be thankful for um and so that's what's traditional that I have always had so much to be thankful for. Uh, just this week, in fact, um, so I, I'm, I'm, I, ha I have diabetes and so I'm on blood sugar medication, but my diabetes has been so well controlled for about the last six months. I've been weaning myself off my medication and so I went and had my A1C checked and it was quite low uh, the last time I had had it checked and it did go up a little bit. And uh, my doctor, my new doctor, she told me uh, she was concerned about my A1C, that it was too low. So she's happy that I got it up a little bit and she said it's still a little low. So she wants me to check it regularly to make sure it doesn't get too low. So I'm, I, and I feel great. Yes, I have back pains and I get stiff like some other 60 year olds. Well, I do have a late stage degenerative bone disease. So that's my good excuse with bulging disc and sciatica, mind you, and a pinched nerve in my neck. And I stepped on some glass, so I got a nerve going up my feet. Anyways, um, let's see. What else am I thankful for? I am so thankful that when I was getting ready to move here to Fairfield, my granddaughter at that time decided that she was going to come with me, although she really didn't want to. She didn't want to move. She didn't want to leave her cat. She didn't want to leave her friends. She didn't want to leave her sister. She didn't want to leave her cousins. She didn't want to leave her surroundings, which I understand. But, you know, I'm her guardian, and I was going to let her go for a while, but then I had to put my foot down because circumstances weren't right. And uh, so now she's here with me. She hasn't complained once and uh she seems to be adjusting quite well so i'm thankful for that i'm thankful for the fact that my mom is alive and she's doing well she's 78 years old my brother just recently got his leg amputated but he's doing well and moving that little leg i'm thankful for all that I'm thankful for Eve's tribe. I'm thankful for my cell tomorrow. I'm thankful for my uh, my daughter, Alyssa, and my grandchildren, and my goddaughter, Sharia, and my godchildren. I'm thankful for my prodigal daughter, Desiree. Desiree, if you're out there, hi, Desiree. Um, so I'm just thankful, and guess what? If you're not thankful, dig down deep, 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 deep and find something to be thankful for. And if you can't do it, look around and see how some people around you might be living. I hate to have to do that in order for you to get thankful. You got to look at other people to see that you're not doing as bad as them. Too bad, huh? But if that's what it takes... Fake it till you make it. Pretend you're grateful because, um, you know, this life is not promised to us. Also, I want to encourage you to own your space. If you're single and you don't have anybody to chill with on Thanksgiving Day, it's okay. We're going to survive the day. We're going to survive the day. And if it's a lonely season even... A rejected season for you. You're going to survive. Own the season. Be grateful that you're alone right now. Do you know how many people wish they had the time and the space that you have to commit to yourself? So just be thankful for your now. Let's try to be thankful for our now. Okay? 
whatever space we're in, whatever we have, whatever is not happening to us that could be happening to us, whatever we didn't get, let's be thankful. Let's just be thankful anyhow. Okay, happy Thanksgiving, happy holidays. I hope you all come to my Black Friday and Cyber Monday sales. God bless you all and have a wonderful holiday season. Bye-bye.